Hey cute friends, I am super excited about this recipe today. It is by The Barefoot Neighbor and it is a chicken cobbler. This recipe has gone viral, I mean like over 35 million views and it's so simple and so easy to put together. So let's get started. The first thing that you do is you just wanna preheat your oven to 350 and then take a nine by 13 casserole dish put one stick of butter in it, and then we're gonna put this in the oven until the butter melts. The butter is melted, and now I'm just gonna take the chicken breast from a rotisserie chicken, and I'm just gonna spread this out evenly. And then to this, I'm going to add one bag of frozen peas and carrots, and this is the 12 ounce bag. And you just pour them on. Let's spread that out evenly. Now, you can flavor this or not, you know, season it the way you want or not. I am gonna add a little bit of the Southern Secret, the Y'all Brand Southern Secret. And this is just onion powder and garlic powder so if you don't have y'all brands, you can just put your own onion powder and garlic powder in it. And this is optional, okay? Next, you take two cups of this Red Lobster Cheddar Bay Biscuit Mix. And really two cups is one of the 11.36 ounce boxes. So you add this to your bowl. And then you wanna add the packet that comes with it, the little seasoning packet. We're gonna mix this up well. And then we're gonna add two cups of milk. And we're gonna mix this well. Next, you take your biscuit mix and you're just gonna pour it right over the top. And we're not gonna stir this. For our last step, we're just gonna take one can of cream of chicken soup. We're gonna add this to our bowl. And then to this, we're gonna add two cups of chicken broth. and then you whisk this together really well. All right, let's pour this over the top. And we're not gonna mix this either. You just pour it over. All right, so let's take our chicken cobbler and stick it in the oven. Again, it's at 350, and we're going to put this in for 45 minutes, and I'll be back. All right, so it was in the oven for 45 minutes, and this is what it looks like. My house smells amazing, <laughs> and I took out a little bit because I wanted it to cool off before I tasted it. So let's do a taste test. Again, I have been wanting to make this for so long, and I'm probably gonna wonder why I waited so long, right? Okay. Mm. Mm, mm, mm. Wow, that is awesome. It's like chicken pot pie, cobbler, all the yummy stuff mixed together. That's a super good recipe. I can see why that has millions and millions of views. Okay, everyone, I hope you try this recipe. Remember, this is from the Barefoot Neighbor, and um, we'll be sure and post this on my website. And you can always find our recipes for free at missannieshomeandkitchen.com. Um, also, you're gonna find 
all the things there. So you'll find all of the sweatshirts, but sweatshirts are headed out. We've got new shirts coming in. You can find the necklaces there. This is a Hope necklace. You can find hats, t-shirts, cookbooks, all the things. So, okay, everybody, thanks so much for joining me and thank you for sharing because we have so many new followers. And so welcome to all of you guys who are new. All right, this is the place for easy, simple recipes and where we know that we can be stronger every day, do hard things and have hope. Okay, everyone, I'll see you next time. Bye.